Hello there, and welcome to another episode of the Nil Plays Random Games. Today we're gonna be playing a torch like Infinite. I found this game from Reddit, and I thought to give it a go, just to see how it is. It's an ARPG, and they call it a burden-free gaming, which I have no idea what that means. They're saying that all gear, affixes, crafting materials, and upgrades are loot-based, which I heavily doubt. Playable on both PC and mobile so Did get you your phone ready phone? Yeah, you guys all have phone. we're gonna be playing the game for around an hour and see if it's any good if you like this type of content feel free to hit the like button maybe even give me a subscribe tell me in the comments how do you feel about mobile games and if you plan on playing this one thanks for watching and hopefully you enjoy tap to start here we go so we have uh five different choices here you can play some kind of a warrior with the two-headed axe uh, not my style really. Berserker Rehan. Okay. Then we have Gunslinger, which is probably my uh, my option that I'm gonna go for. Then we have this lady with big personality, which is really nice always. I like this fire and ice thingy going on. Then we have this dude. Ooh, this one sounds pretty cool. It's like uh, some kind of a staff. Kind of like a monk or Wukong. Looks kind of like a dwarf. So you assume this is like the engineer class. It's gonna make a robot pretty sick uh yeah I, I think the choice is very clear for me though commander moto okay so the, my choice is between the uh, the gunslinger and the fire and ice mage but i think this time we're gonna go for the um let's go for the gunslinger yeah let's pick let's pick this guy we got my name and we're good to go interesting that there's no uh voice acting here feels so empty when there's no voice like narrating the uh the cutscene and here we are. A trill voice. Wake up. Tap left mouse button to move to the target. Okay. Nice. We're gonna interact with this. Okay. We got skills. And we got a new skill. Eye shot. Multiple projectiles. Install. Okay. So I assume it's gonna shoot more projectiles. Oh, okay, so now it does like a three bullets. That's pretty cool. Join us. Okay, we got we got them killed. Continue through the domain. There's some something glowing already. It's the mail. Server maintenance. Give me give me everything. Otherwise I'm gonna hit be hit by some serious FOMO. Oh wow. You actually take quite a bit of damage. Damn. You gotta be a bit more careful here. Unable to use attack skills. Oh, no, no. Oh. Control your true power. Is that some kind of ultimate? I'm not sure. Oh, we gotta kill so many mobs. It actually feels pretty nice to kill all these mobs. And then we get some kind of uh, Super Saiyan mode. I do like that. The fleeting voice that will only end in death. It's gonna be a boss. It's a tentacle monster. Straight from the hentai. Ooh, look at big numbers. I can feel the dopamine flowing through my body when I see big numbers. Let's go. Ooh. Oh, yes. It's gonna be how the gameplay is. I just spam my mouse button. And the boss is dead. And we get saved by the angel. Kinda expect voice acting, but then again, it's a mobile game, so does anyone care about the voice acting in this game? Most likely not. Oh, she has a nice personality too. Yes, take me. I guess that was the tutorial. And here we are. Right from the bat, like the fact that you can't change your UIs is a little bit annoying. I hope that all the mobile game devs gonna make that like a basic feature. Skip. Tap the quest bar to follow the path. We have an auto path thing. So no auto path thing. A weird choice. Got some mobs to kill again. Oh, I don't feel as powerful as I did in the uh, tutorial, so... I have two quests. Okay, I think we got another skill. Because we leveled up, so let's see. What did we get? Fast reload. So I think we got another uh, skill slot. We have another skill slot, so we can put a skill on that. So let's 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 take a... Take a blink. And we're gonna install blink here. Okay, I click something and we got more mobs. Let's go. Try the blink here. Ooh, that actually feels pretty good. Yeah, that feels quite nice. I don't know, like, that's very interesting. We got a new helmet to equip. Is there a visual change on my character? 
Looks like no. So I assume the uh, the potions like recharge over time. So it's like a stacking thing. I am surprised that there's no auto um, passing. Oh, it's getting uh, when I'm killing the mobs, I'm getting the potion. I see. Okay, we got some kind of boss here. Drops me a gear. Nice. Okay, that just killed everything for me. Thank you. Oh, there's more. That one is dead. That's it. Okay, we got it. A bunch of losers. Oh, we gotta kill this guy. I gotta say the blink is quite amazing. Like, it feels pretty good to blink around. And it's only a two second cooldown. So I'm actually pretty happy with the blink. And we got him. Oh, he's doing a Kamehameha. Nice block, man. Thank you. Good job blocking that. Okay, so we're level three now. And we got a bunch of gear from that. Also, we unlock talents. Main stat, strength, attacks, uh, attack, fire. Dex, speed, and lightning. Spell and cold. Strength, dex, chance, dex, and... E so I think the uh, option here is the, the go goddess of hunting. Let's pick that one. Gives you a full-on talent tree. Okay, we have 12% damage, life and energy shield, and lightning damage. We're gonna go for damage because we like damage. Who doesn't? Then we also got a bunch of gear. Go into the bag. Got this crossbow. Let's put it on. We also got a cannon. Cool. Okay, so there's gonna be an energy shield gear. Like in, in PoE. But I think we go for evasion. And now I think we can actually get the skill. So if you like fast reload, a blink bow. Oh, we can we can swap the blink to that one, I think. Let's try that. What does this cost anyway? You can buy them. Oh, okay. Keep on going. Uh, I think I have a multiple quest here no we're just following a, a single quest line we gotta go to the ancient passage here we are broody oh we got a waypoint okay this is pretty good we're doing like i i think i like the blink a bit more though this one doesn't seem that good but uh, we will roll with that one for now at least it does damage the blink doesn't do any damage so it's uh it's a bit bad i guess you can move that way i guess it's a boss it has no cooldown? Are you kidding me? Oh, I think it shoots an arrow too, right? Is that a player? Oh, it does shoot an arrow. Okay. But I'm kind of... It's not that good because you keep going back. I'm not a fan of that. But I do like the skill. Because it shoots the arrow, which is kind of nice. Oh, there is a reload mechanic here. We are level 4. Amazing. What do we get when we hit level 4? A new talent node available. That's a lot of damage for that. What do we get next? More damage. Attack and cast speed. Oh, I like that one. Yeah, I do like this line quite a bit. Maybe I should go for the attack speed next. Well, we're gonna get level 5 so we can get another slot, so... Let's keep going for now. Are people surprised that this game is pay to win? It's a cool looking boss. Oh, we got the boss. Unlock hero ranking. Oh, we gotta go kill the cannon, I think. Okay, so let's check what we got. Get another skill slot. Which we don't really have much of a skill here. We could put this one on. Bro, let's, let's pick this one. Install. What else do we have? Uh, we got talents, right? Yeah. Ooh, let's take more damage. Ancient Battleground. We got a quest here. And another waypoint, which is nice. Kill all the mobs. Pretty good. Oh, this one has a cooldown. Also, do we get any items? Let's see. We got a blue helmet. I like that. Let's put it on. We also got uh, some pistols. The game actually doesn't feel too bad. Like, the combat is pretty nice. It's, it, I think it's better than I expected. To be honest, the fact that there seems to be no out of play too is kind of kind of interesting that they went that way. Ice spawn and thunder. Oh, okay. So it's gotta keep tracking the quest and keep on going. How do we get past the? Uh... Wait for Cory to repair the wooden bridge. Okay, so he's gonna he's gonna repair it. We're gonna protect him while he repairs the uh... the bridge. So. We also got a new bow as a drop. It's nice. Oh, it's done. Thanks, Corey. We actually have normal bows too. That's nice. Also, new talent point. So we're gonna go for this one now. Because more attack speed is always nice too. Yeah, this is definitely so much faster. Hey. Ooh, that hurts a lot. I just keep running on that. I wonder when we get that upgraded uh, to the point where it shoots more. Okay, we're just gonna keep moving forward. I think what we're gonna do is I'm gonna swap to the blink. Because I really like the blink. Don't really like this one at all. We're gonna upgrade this one too. Now we now it has a slot. What is this residue? 19.5% restoration effect from uh, supported skills. Supported restoration skills become instant. You get more when you're low HP. I think I'm gonna pick this one. Let's keep going. Oh, 
I think I keep missing buff. That's okay. I wonder what you do with the gear that you get. Like, is there a way to trash all this gear? Because we're getting a lot of items. There is a destroy button there, which makes me wonder if you need to destroy or if there's like a way to, um, there might be a way to salvage your gear. Oh, okay. We upgraded blink bow now. Please select reward. Can I already buy all these? Where's the currencies in this game? I'm confused. It doesn't seem to have any currencies. Maybe I'm not far enough yet. Okay, we got another cutscene. Like that. The speed on this game actually, I saw some people play it a little bit and damn, they were going really quickly like, we to kill the cannon, yeah, okay, we got it, we got another talent point, let's go and put in more speed, I like it, I think we, we have a new skill to, uh, to unlock, so we can have that, but we can now use rain of arrows, it's nice, I'm always a fan of rain of arrows, so let's buy this one, let's install it to that slot, then we actually have a blink, oh yeah, that's good. That's very good. I like that. I like that a lot. I'm a bit weak, for sure. I might actually die here at some point. I'm going like a full glass cannon. We got blue boots. Are they any good? Lightning resistant? Eh, pretty, pretty same boots, what I already have. Nothing too interesting here. Oh, this one hurts. What the hell? I don't think the rain of arrows does much damage, but... Maybe if you get it upgraded, it might be better, but for now, it's... This one is much better. Oh, interesting. 110. Yeah, 189. That makes sense. That's why it's so much better. Go to Bullcore's core. We got these two dudes with me. It's a boss time. Pretty nice music here, too. Oh, I went into that one. Oh, that was a loud skill. Too loud, man. Oh! Oh boy, that was pretty, pretty cool boss. Easy, but I think this is still kind of a tutorial, so can't really blame them. And here we go. We got, uh, we actually got a rifle from that, a blue one. So I think we're gonna put that on. We can't use rain of arrows anymore, so we gotta swap that out. I will lose damage with these. That's okay. We need to swap the skill. We also have a new talent node, so we can get the attack speed. Let me just get that one. Perfect. It's gonna be like a yeah, full on like evasion build again. We also have to swap the skill because we can't use the uh, the rain of arrows. So what are we picking here? Try that. What does that do? 15% damage for the next perk class skill per stack of buff. And we did the boss. That was pretty cool. Here we are in the next zone. What is this? Hey, push for a hero. Oh, this is the leveling event. Then we have the season challenge, some login rewards, all the basic stuff for a, for a mobile game. Gets my uh, FOMO going pretty hard. Seven day login. Give me all the rewards, man. I need it all. And proceed to top up. Uh, maybe not. Really? You get an auto pickup? You have to pay for that? Are you sure? We have to pay for that? Where do you get to the store? Oh, there we go. So, we can be in the store. Oh, they have to double on the first purchase. So, basically, you have to buy this one. Otherwise, you're losing money. 300 Prima Crust after purchase. Oh, they have this login thing. So, what can we buy? Cash shop doesn't seem too bad, I guess. Well, let's keep going. Can we, can we sell everything? Like, do we actually sell trader? We get some kind of dust. Oh, interesting. So, you should not destroy anything. Please select your reward. Okay, we got a jump. Wind projectiles. Slow projectiles. Beast chance. What's the last one? A mark. Oh, I like jump. Let's pick a jump. Oh, wow. We got a lot of the different ones now. Tap to select the main skill. Interesting. So, what does this mean? Selecting main skill. Spend energy to increase the uh, a number of links for a skill. Okay, okay, I see what it is. I got it. Merits. Are these like uh, achievements? Yeah, okay. There's something we need, we can take here. Progression. Claim. So many things to claim. As always. Oh, there we go. Still no claim all. Go to the dragon bone ridge via the teleporter. Oh, I still got these uh, minions with me. Cross the dragon bone bridge. I don't think my chain works. Man, the auto loot would be so good. Okay, it does chain up. That's nice. Yeah, I definitely like the gunslinger character. Ooh, is that my first legendary? Nice. Let's see what it does. 
Diamond face card. Okay, okay. Not very good for me, but I think we're gonna take it. I'm gonna put it on anyway. Okay, we're gonna kill all these um, elites. I think we can just skip all the mobs, to be honest. We'll just kill the um, elites. Okay, we got a boss fight here. Ooh, this one is pretty good. Like a windy boss. Well done, partner. Thank you. There we go. We got more levels to my uh, eye shot. Main skill for now. Let me go back to dragons. Level 9. Let's go. Uh, we got a new talent point. So we can go for this one, which is attack speed or movement speed. I think we go for this one. Yeah, definitely. A 12% maximum mana, 5 mana restore on hit. That could be interesting, but... 15% mobility skill with cooldown recoveries. Oh, we got another slot. We're about to hit level 10 soon. Let me get some more... Get some more FOMO items. I like how low the cooldown is on the... Um, on the movement thingies. Movement skills. Get a blue hat. Not sure if that's any, any good. Whoa. Interesting. I feel like my attack speed is uh, faster if I'm just standing still. What the hell? I'm gonna die to this boss? No way. Kills are cool though. Oh! I did it! I didn't die. Nice. That was close though. Whoa. Way too close. Imagine dying in a mobile game. Oof. That's a big oof. But we got some new gear from that, which is kind of nice. Let's see. This one increases the skill area, but I don't think it's better. No, it's not better. This one is not even close being better. Damn, I'm getting some shit gear. Interesting. We got jump. Let's upgrade that one. Fast reload. Sure. Ask Molina for a permission. Okay, so we got a choice of emergency avoidance or quick mobility. Supported skills have 20% attack and cast speed. Gain stack of buff when using a support skills. The buff lasts 4 seconds, stacking up 4 times. Oh, this is gonna be a hard choice. I kinda like this one. We don't have a slot here. Is this how you get the slot? How do I remove this? Like, I can't. Okay. Go to the lost mines. Okay. I go kill the dwarves. Kill them dwarves. I like that. Get some big boys here that we gotta kill. I thought these guys would be friendly, but... It's like they're not. And we hit the level 10. Going through this dungeon, we actually got a new talent node for level 10. So we can get some movement speed. But I think we go for this one. Shock. Max life. Okay. Does this elevator work? No. Oh, we're going wrong way. Gotta go this way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Actually takes so much damage. Look at all these bombs. Damn. So many bombs on the ground. Gotta level up to blink. Good. Need some more level ups. But I do really like the blink. I think the blink is really good. Scout gloves. Oh, pretty good. Can take those. Oh, we got a robot now with us. Nice. We might be killing too many mobs anyway. Okay, we got a rifle from that. Oh, levels to my skills. I don't know about the reload mechanic. Seems a bit awkward. We got another boss. It's like a butcher. Does that skill actually reload too? We got level 11. Damn, we're just flying through the levels. Does this also reload? Change, charge forward and gain a bonus that increases damage of next projectiles. It doesn't say that it reloads. Yeah, it doesn't reload anything. We got another talent node. Large talent node not selected. Oh, there's a big ones here. So we got a perception. 1% attack and cast speed per 15 dexterity. 100% additional mobility skill cooldown recovery speed. 4% minus 4% targets lightning resistance for 2 second lightning damage hit. Flicker. Wow. Okay. We have like no cooldown on our... Uh, Mobility skills now. Oh, yeah, we got a new skill. Oh, that's true. A lightning shot. 
install. Okay, I'm very curious how that's gonna work. Let's find out. Might be the skill that we need. got a necklace nice a better chest piece always good a one-handed pistol which actually has more damage than the other one hmm this single pistol is actually better than what i have yeah let's put these two on i guess oh we got a bow is that better what do we have though let's see 49 dps bow yes please we can't use fast Reload with this one. Can you not reset these? Okay, what if you change? That skill is limited to guns. Do we have any kind of a bow skill here? A bull rage. You know what? We're just gonna use the blink bow. I mean, that's just working, you know? It just works. A boss? We got a bloodthirst and we got to aim. So I guess buying skills is not that smart because you keep getting these skills anyway. And we got new gloves, which are pretty bad. Is it based? Is it like a slot? Is this slot based? It is slot based. Okay. So what I need to do, I need, I need to swap. You need to change this one. How do you take off the slots? Okay, here we go. No, not that one. Crap. Lightning shot. There we go. Actually, you know what? Put the lightning shot here. There we go. That's perfect. Gotta put the heal here. I don't know what we put here, though. Really nothing interesting to put into that slot. Let's go. Heart of Kazan. I, think it's I feel like it's gonna be a boss time. Oh, not yet, I guess. Oh, I do so much damage now. Bow is pretty nice. A dwarf king. Ooh. You gotta be fighting some robot here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's like barely any cooldown on, on that blink. Probably not a good idea to not have any cooldowns. Oh, it's gonna be another boss dead. Easy, the Dwarf King is dead. That rune must be a key. Okay, any good items here? Let's find out. There's a musket, got a chest piece, which is an armor piece. But I think we need the evasion cure. I think that's like my, my stuff that I need. Uh, we got a helmet. Damn, it's still worse than what I have. Interesting. A lightning resistance. Okay, we're not, nothing too good here. Gear wise, got nothing. Got a talent point. Take. Uh, or evasion. Let me get this one, which is pretty nice. Surgery road. Another boss dead.